Greetings CPA students and welcome to week two of Fieldwork 6203. This is video one for this week. So these slides have a lot of duplication with the slides from last week. Just as a gentle reminder, I did post slides last week and there is a task um, that you need to do in those slides. So this week, um, this is what we'll cover in the PowerPoints. And if you attend the one hour optional synchronous class on Monday, um, this is the agenda that I'll be following. I'm just gonna really briefly go over these things. Make sure everybody remembers the personal career objectives in your field placement assignment one is due and make sure you can do it. And then we'll jump right to how to find a placement. Okay, so this again is from last week. Gentle reminder that unlike probably any other course you've taken at the college, you must complete every assignment. Even though this is a pass fail course, you must complete every assignment in order to pass. So in the past, you might've kind of blown off a small assignment worth 5% and decided, meh, I'm not going to do that one. I've already got an 80 in the class. Doesn't work that way in a pass fail course. In this course, you have to do every single assignment in order to pass. Okay, so these are the five assignments that you need to do. Um, please read the information about them on the screen, including in the notes. Okay, so again, this was last week. Gentle reminder to review the slides I shared with you in the fall. For those of you who are hoping to use your um, work study experience, or maybe you have a job where you've been working in IT in the past two years, and you wanna use that experience to get exemption, for completing the 160 hour placement. Make sure you read the field placement manual, go into DC Connect, and you'll see a folder where it describes how you go about doing that. And note that it's due February 3rd. So if you haven't submitted a request by February 3rd, I look forward to learning where you're gonna go for your field placement. Okay, so last week I assigned um, completing a career objectives, so getting you to think about career objectives. And, and we talked about SMART goals in ITSE class. And if you are in my ITBU class, we're gonna be talking about SMART goals this week. Well, I kinda want you to SMART goal, make a SMART goal for the next four weeks on how you're gonna secure a placement. I need you to make a plan. What are you gonna do? What actionable things are you gonna do? What milestones are you gonna set so that you know if you're on track to have a placement secured by the due date. So that assignment is the one um, I talked about last week. All right, um, we're gonna stop here with the video and I'll start a new video because this is the new content for this week. <laughs> 